Hey guys, happy September. Here we are in the fall and January is going to be coming up in a few months. I'm really not trying to like push us to go faster than we all feel like we're going. But I thought, you know what? Um, taking in a September inventory of where we are, where maybe we wanted to be. Okay, so let me back up a little bit. Last January, there are always things, or there are many times there are things that we say we want to begin doing in the new year, correct? So taking a September inventory can be helpful to see, okay, was there something I told myself I wanted to do in January? Have I done it? You know, where am I in that process if I have or I have not done it? And if you haven't done it, it's okay. You haven't done it, okay? It's really okay. But I thought it'd be great if we could take like an inventory right now about if you didn't start or do or commit to something that you said you wanted to do back in January, think about doing it now and maybe do it now before this next new year, okay? So that you can actually start to feel better about yourself. And I say this often, it's not that you have to make a huge change. We can make small steps, small movement towards the change that we desire to make. So if all you can handle right now is gearing up for the fact that you know you're going to be changing something, right? I don't know about you, but that really helps me. Like if I know there's something that I need to do, right? And I can be a procrastinator for sure. But if I know if I know there's something that I need to do, I may not have the motivation to do it. I may be too tired. I may have too much going on in my life, whatever that is. But I'm also saying to myself, okay, you know, you're going to do it. You're getting ready. You're going to do it. I used to have the negative self-talk was beating myself up because I hadn't done it beating myself up because I never did do things that maybe I said I was going to do. Whatever the story is for you, you can just change your mindset. You can adopt one you know, physical action towards doing something, making a change. If it's a new job, Google today, get on the internet, take a look at things, right? There are things that you want to do. If you want to brand, branch out, get out on your own, work for yourself, Start doing a little bit of homework. You know, what is it that you need to do? Make a list, make a top 10 list of the things that you know you need to do to start gathering more information. Because the more information we have about things, we can make better decisions, right? So this is really taking an inventory and saying, okay, what is it that I've been telling myself that I want to do that I haven't done? And that's okay, okay? Obviously it wasn't the right time. Maybe now is the right time for you. The other thing I guess I want to throw out is when we keep not doing the thing we say we want to do, there is absolutely a reason why we're not. Could be fear, right? Oftentimes it is fear. Could be fear of failure. Could be fear just in general of taking a step towards something that's real unknown for me. It makes me feel unsettled. Sometimes we have connections in our past that keep us or thought patterns from our past, right? That keep us kind of like going around in circles and not able to move and take action in our lives today. And I'm actually about to do a program called Shift One Thing Now. And I guess I'll talk about it because I'm gonna run this, I think I'm gonna run this actually next month. So in Shift One Thing Now, I feel like this is a great way to take one thing and change it, okay? What the program offers is you get videos, weekly videos, and worksheets. This is a four-week program. There is an extra week in it just because I, you know, as soon as we're done with the program, I don't want to feel like people are like left. Um, so it's like a transition week. And during each week, the four weeks, you receive worksheets and you receive uh, half an hour of one-on-one -on -one Zoom time with me so that we can work on this and you can ask questions and I go over the questions and we can actually dialogue about things that, you know, that, that are holding you back, that you feel are holding you back. And then I will perhaps help you maybe navigate some other reasons why maybe you're not taking action, right? 
And so you can get coached during this process of Shift One Thing Now, which I think is really awesome. So that is, that's it. That's it for September. And keep your eye out for Shift One Thing Now. Um, I will try to actually have a link in this newsletter so that you guys can sign up uh, or reach out and talk to me about it if you would like to, instead of just committing first. If you have any more questions, I wanna be available to you because it is a personal thing to change something in our lives. Um, and I think that's it, okay. So let this time inspire you, let September inspire you so that you can go ahead and take action towards the thing that you really and truly would like to change or do or overcome in your life and not wait until January to think about it, okay? All right, have a great one. I will talk to you next month, thanks.